Okay, there you go guys. In this video, I will demonstrate how to load multiple avatar as well as apply different poses onto the avatar. To do so, first I'm here in this favorite which is under library tab. We want to double click on this avatar folder here to open. And first I want to open the female underscore v2 avatar. And I'm going to select right here, Yuna. And be sure we are selecting fv2 underscore Yuna, okay? So next I'm going to simply switch the window down here to only 3D window. Simply click on that 3D icon to select. Next we want to load the male avatar. To load the male avatar, I can either come back over here to this avatar folder or I can double click on this main folder right here. And now I'm going to go back to male underscore v2 and I'm going to select Thomas here. Simply double click on this avatar to open and instead of open, I want to check this add box here. And right now by default, I have one meter. And if I look down here under unit, I have M, which is stand for meter. That is perfect for me. I'm going to, instead of one meter, I'm going to type in minus one meter. Then I'm going to click on okay. Next. We want to load another avatar and I'm going to simply come back to the folder, double click on it. And this time I will double click on the kit V1 and scroll down here. I want to select this one here, Isla. Simply double click on the avatar and once again check this add box here. And this time I'm going to type in 1 and then click on OK. So now I'm going to apply the poses onto this avatar. To apply the poses, I have two options. Either apply the poses in the avatar folder, and you can apply, for example, male poses to female or female to children, no problem. You can switch this between all these avatars. Okay. Simply go to avatar and then I can select female and then go to pose, open that and then let's select one of these posts right here. Double click on it. And I'm going to bring this window up here a little bit and select Yuna. So this post right now, it is highlighted in yellow. If I click on OK, I'm going to leave everything as is and click on OK. So next, we can also change to different poses. For example, select another one here. I can also apply the same post to all avatar. Simply click on it, click on this, click on this, and then click on OK. And then simply click on OK again. Now all the avatar have the same poses. Next, I want male have different pose and female. Simply go to avatar again and repeat the step. Or I can go to my folder here. So next I'm going to click on that clone item there. And I'm going to select my own pose here. Let's change this to icon view so we get to see it better, okay? Let's see, I like this pose right here. I'm going to double click on it and then once again, I'm going to select Juna and then click on OK and click on OK again. So next I'm going to find an OK how about this pose right here. Double click on here and I'm going to apply that onto Thomas and click on OK, click on OK again. Next, let's find one more pose. OK, I kind of like this pose here. And by the way, guys, as you can see right here, I'm applying the pose MV2 underscore, which is male version 2 avatar. I'm going to double click on that and I'm going to select Isla, OK, and then click on OK and OK again. There you go. So when it's come to poses, I can apply any pose to any avatar. No problem. However, though, when it's come to accessory, that's a little bit different. We have to apply to the exact avatar and accessory that they're designed for. For example, shoe here, we have female version 2 avatar. It's only work for version 2 avatar, okay? If I double click on here and automatically apply it to her. Let's change the kid shoe and then we can look for male shoe, okay? Let's give her this. Sandal here, double click, and then now she has this cute sandal. And then look for, okay, right here, this is male shoe. I'm going to double click 
Now it actually automatically apply it to mail. So there you have it design this store. I hope you guys found the video helpful and remember to give it a thumbs up and follow me on Include Fashion for more awesome videos like this. Thanks for watching guys!